Let's see, Benchy, I usually print the stupid cat models that come on the printer. That's someone, I think, who's been messing with Creality printers for a little bit. Unless I'm thinking of a different one. Do you guys remember the money cat, the little money cat that, like, you know, you go in the, the, the like, Chinese places and it's going like this, but there was, like, the test print where it was, like, the little money cat with the fist, with the scroll? Um, here's a little bit of 3D printing lore that most people have forgotten about or not, or not even aware of. So, when the Creality CR10s came out, um, they came with CaliCat.g code on the card. So, um, it was a test print and what people found out, and I think what happened was at some point, however, they were putting those files on the cards, the image got corrupted. So what would happen was when you would print the, the little cat test print, people would be posting in the CR 10 Facebook groups all the time, every single day, multiple times a day. Uh, why is my print failing? 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 Okay. Um, <laughs> and what would happen was as it's printing, right as it got to the collar, the printer would screw up. The G code would freak out. The head would move off to the side, off to the front. It would screw the print up, but then it would start printing again. So basically it would decapitate the cat and it got to be known as Decapicat um, among the the, uh, the the 3D printing groups. So that's a little um, a little thing. I, how many of you guys have heard of that story, of the Decapicat story? Because it was a, it was a problem. We literally because uh, we have our, our we have a CR10 group. I think we have one of the largest CR10 groups still on the TH3D runs. Um, and we had a pin post and we told people if you guys post a question about this because you're clearly not reading it's in the pinned thing like faqs um we're just going to remove you from the group because it was just spam of of people asking why is my print failing when it was literally just the g-code was corrupted slice a file on your own and and it'll work um <laughs> it's it's crazy so yeah and mine did it too. I wish I would. I should have saved that file. I wonder if somebody uh, f uh, saved it. Actually, I think somebody made. Give me one sec. On Thingiverse, I think somebody made. It was on here. I don't know if they removed it. I see. I told you, I'm not playing with you guys here. Oh, and this is amazing. Look at, so somebody made, made, made this, the actual decapicat there. This is, this is a response to the corrupt cat.g code that is preloaded on the SD card for the CR 10 printers. I use mesh mixture to move its head and move its head to the paw. And then here, this guy literally made <laughs> just a head you can print to shove in the bottom field print. And this is what it's supposed to look like. That's that's what it's supposed to look like. And here, here's more of the the decapicat. Many have ended up with decapicat that cuts its head off, but this one printed excellent for me. So he, uh, this guy, uploaded his his cat.g code that isn't broken. I'm gonna download this just for funsies, just so I have the STL. I'm gonna I, I'm gonna I think I'm gonna have to print some some cats. I, th I think I have to do one of those. If you like this clip, this is taken from our Ask Tim stream that we do every Wednesday at 4 p.m. Central Time. So if you want to watch that whole stream, you can go ahead and click here. Otherwise, you can go ahead and hit the subscribe button and make sure to change the bell to all notifications to get notified when we go live in the future.